Hi everybody, this is Connie and welcome back to my adult coloring obsession series. I um, thought I would talk to you again. This is another Dollar Tree coloring book and this one here is a Mandela's and it's red as you can see. There's several different ones. There's 32 designs here. The only thing is, the only reason you can really tell it's a Dollar Tree one, it's, it's, it's colored on both sides. So what I plan to do on these is go ahead and um, like copy this page and then color this page. So anyway, here is the, the print that is on the front side to color. And look at this. Wow, wow, wow. Isn't that beautiful? I love that. Trying to get this so you can see both pictures in the deal here. These are going to, wow, these are busy. Very busy. But they are a challenge, aren't they? Pretty. Look at that. Look at the butterflies here. And a mandala. Only it goes out. Wow. Another mandala. Hence the name, mandalas. This one's got ice cream cones and ice cream bowls and ice cream sundaes. Wow. I love this. Oh, and this one's got, there's pizza, pizza box, pizza slice, whole pizza right there. Looks like uh, noodles maybe, pasta. Wow. I like this one. This would be fun. A great big, uh, looks like a bluebird. More birds and the sun. How fun. See, I haven't even looked at some of these books, so all these pictures are new to me, too. Here's an elephant sitting down. Oh, look at this one. This one's going to be fun. It, it looks like Eiffel Towers. Can you see it? Almost looks like Eiffel Towers coming up. Right here. All right, um, wow, oh my God, everything is so tiny in this one. It's going to take me forever to do that one. That's probably one that I wouldn't do on camera because I don't think, I think you guys would get bored way before I was done with that one. This one looks like fun. This one here looks like one that we could do on camera. Another busy one. Holy cow. Look at all these little intricate, beautiful flowers around this one. Uh, toucan. Is that what they're called? And there we go. Another bird. How beautiful are they? Wow. Let me read to you what this says. Mandalas are beautiful and intricate designs with a rich cultural history. Originating in Buddhist and Hindu practices, mandalas traditionally represent the universe. Each mandala contains a myriad of motifs and designs, many times elaborately colored and accented, and are frequently presented as offerings to deities. Perhaps the most well-known iterations are the Tibetan sand mandalas. Those exquisite mandalas are painstakingly arranged by monks who often spend hours carefully arranging the colored sand to create the various stages designs contained within. Once complete, the mandalas is erased in a ritualized manner and the sand is then poured into the flowing body of water. This act of creation and destruction is meant to represent the impertinence, permanence of life. While mandalas can be incredibly intricate, 
and therefore daunting, they do present a wonderful opportunity to color and explore. In this book, you will find 32 large Mandela designs, each complex in their beauty, but anyone can color them, even if you don't like to color between the lines. You can use crayons, colored pencils, or markers. Mandelas have meanings to many people, and by coloring the Mandelas in this book, you will surely find your own. There you go. Isn't that beautiful? That is really a pretty one. I will see you next time in uh, my coloring book obsession. Bye-bye.